Hello, everyone. Happy Halloween. I wanted to come on because I know I've gotten so many people ask me, what travel system did you go with for the twins? And I had the travel system already, but I was waiting to pick the car seat that I wanted. So as you can see, it's kind of hard to show it all in the frame because it's so long. But the travel system that Jarrett and I picked was the City Select Baby Jogger. I absolutely love this baby jogger. It has gotten so many rave reviews for parents of multiples. And one of the things that I really, really wanted was something compact, not double wide, something with rubber wheels and have the longevity to take them all the way up to their toddler stage and past. So that's what we got. We got this at Bye Bye Baby. Uh, a month ago, two months ago, and we just been toying with it, you know, testing it out, you know, folding it up. Uh, it did come with the toddler seats. They're not on the stroller as you see right now. We have them put away, um, but it did not come with the car seats. So when you buy higher end, there's a lot of things that you have to buy extra. So, of course, it only comes with the toddler seats, so we had to get the um, car seats. And another thing is, with the City Select Baby Jogger, if you want to get another car seat and not get the car seat that goes with the stroller, you have to buy these bars, as you see here, that are separate. I didn't like the car seat that went with the baby jogger. There was a couple of things I didn't like about it. So we bought the bar for the car seat on Amazon. And when I bought it, I walked into Babies R Us and they had one on clearance on their clearance table. So I returned one of the bars um, and got my $54 back uh, because the one at Babies R Us was 17 and it was on clearance and they only had one. So we saved on one of them. So as you can see, it's set up. So there's the bar system and it's holding the car seat. Now the car seat. Let me tell you, ladies and gentlemen, and I'm sure we all have our opinions out there. It's very overwhelming for a first time mommy to pick a car seat. Some of you out there are pros. You have children. Um, a lot of us have different viewpoints on car seats, on what they feel is what's best, what's better. Let me just tell you, I did my research upon research upon research until my brain was literally fried. Um, when I went to Bye Bye Baby, of course, they have all the expensive brands there. Chico, Up A Baby. Um, paid Perego. Oh gosh, so many other ones. And they are very expensive car seats. Very expensive. Yes, there are affordable car seats out there that you can buy that are from $100, $150. My problem was with those individually car seats like that, they weren't padded enough. They were very cheaply made. I wanted something that was going to be sturdy, something that the babies could really grow into. A lot of the car seats out there in the market, your baby can't grow into the car seat. So I had fallen in love with one by Paid Prego. That car seat was like $349. It was outrageous. I mean, just for one wouldn't be so bad, but I have two that I have to buy. Well, at Bye Bye Baby, they do not take coupons. Um, well, they do take coupons. I'm sorry. Let me just correct myself. They are sister company to Bath, Bed, and Beyond. So your 20% coupon that you have, I took in and I thought I could use it on their car seats. Wrong. You cannot use the 20% off on high-end uh, travel systems or high-end uh, car seats. I didn't see that written at the bottom, but when the man showed me 
it did say something about that in there. I can't remember exactly what the wording is. It was just like such a shock. I was like, are you kidding me? So I knew that I needed to look around some more. So I went to Babies R Us and found the Chico Fit 2. It has a stage one and a stage two. So that means the stage one is from zero to 12 months. Stage two is from nine to 24 months. That's how this car seat operates. It has two stages where the baby could grow to get more longevity out of the car seat. Um, I needed something that started at zero or four pounds and up, just in case my babies are preemie. And I wanted something that was, sorry, I'm just paying attention to my cat. <clears throat> really well constructed, and I know it's dark. So let me turn, there you go. You can see it better here. It has really nice padding without being too overly fluffed. It has a nice head support. You can remove this, and then this is for the when the baby gets bigger. It has a nice, easy, clean um, material that you can clean very well. It has a nice hood. And like I said, this can grow with the baby. So the back of this actually pulls up. So your baby can, um, you know, when they get longer, this back goes up. And I know it's hard to describe um, right here's the handle in the back. So I would try to demonstrate it for you, but I'm using one hand right now. I don't have my tripod out. So we got two of these. And the cool thing about Babies R Us is they stack coupons, even on clearance items um, and on sale items. This car seat was $273. It was clearance to $230, to $230 because I was registered at Bye Bye ba or Babies RS. They gave me 10% off each car seat because I'm having twins. I had an account with them, a card, so they gave me an extra 25% off each car seat. So when I walked out the door, I got each car seat for $177, which is so freaking amazing. I can't even tell you guys how happy Jarrett and I were that we got a car seat we really wanted. For the price of one car seat, it would have cost me a bye-bye baby. So we're very, very happy about that. So this is how the boys will be. One, one baby will be here, one baby will be there. This car seat, you can function all different ways. I can have them face each other. It has different options on how you can put the baby. Um, this right here was a gift to me by Jarrett's um, aunt. You can put your cell phone here. It has a detachable like little clutch bag. Um, it has a magnetic opening right here to put things in and then two cup holders. So that's really cool. And then down here at the bottom, this part gets strapped down here to the other bar and you can store things, toys or jackets for the boys. So I'm very happy with this. Sorry, my cat is just acting like a little brat right now. So I cannot wait to try this bad boy out and take the boys out. Not too much longer, guys. I'm seven months. So I will be 29 weeks on Monday. And all is well right now. I know some of you guys may have seen my Instagram post. I have to retake my glucose test. Uh, I didn't pass the first one. So I will take the second one and cross cross my fingers. I passed that one. I've had to be on a low carb, no sugar diet. And that has been very difficult um, adjusting. You know, I'm not good with change. I don't know who is. And when your life gets just turned upside down, and you have to just change overnight, it's hard. It's hard to get in that mentality. And I know it's for the babies. I know it's something I have to do. But when you have to go out grocery shopping and meal plan, it is very time consuming and hard. You have to look at everything on the back of the labels to see if it has sugar in it, how many carbs are in it, and it's exhausting. 
so this week has my has been my adjustment week for that trying to get in the groove of of eating like this this new lifestyle and even if i pass my second glucose test i am better more aware of things behind labels and paying attention more and I will probably stick to this diet, but not to the extreme that I am right now and just be more aware. But my heart goes out to anyone, anyone that has diabetes, that has to deal with this on an everyday basis. I have so much more of a better understanding about it, what you have to go through on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, hats off to all of you that have to live with diabetes, you know, with di with uh, um, the diabetes that I may have, they don't know if I have it yet, not until I take the second test, digestional diabetes, it goes away once you give birth. Um, it's in the placenta. So, um, and then you have to get tested like two times, I believe, after you give birth to make sure it's fully gone away. So, um, this is something that I just have to put up with for the next month and a half, two months. I couldn't imagine having to deal with this for a lifetime. So anyway, I wanted to just keep this short, show you the travel system. Sorry for the lighting. It's kind of an overcast day today for Halloween. It's about 59 outside. I think we're supposed to get 80 today. So um, I'm enjoying the weather with the door open right now. And then um, I have two appointments today, my high risk and my regular doctor. They're just regular appointments. And we're going to see the boys on the ultrasound today. And I'm going to dress up as Winnie the Pooh because <laughs> I've got the belly for it. And I made my costume, so I'll wear it to both doctor's appointments. And I'm just really, really excited to take a photo and always remember this particular Halloween because next Halloween, I'm going to be a busy mommy. <laughs> and I'll have two little munchkins um, to take out for Halloween next year. So uh, I'm just on cloud nine right now, guys. So thank you all for your continued support and your prayers. Um, thank you for sticking around and watching my channel, even though it doesn't have anything to do with Reborns anymore. Uh, I appreciate all of you guys so much for just continuing to watch and be on this adventure with me. So, all right, that's about it, guys. Thank you for watching. Toodles.